Hello everyone, my name is Charlie and welcome to another geocaching video. We are currently in a small village called Dumbleton. I am going to get a few traditional caches. There are about, well, I think it's about four traditional caches, so it's going to be a good walk. There's going to be some steep climbs in places and the best part of it is, is there's a geocache just before the start line. When I mean the start line, I mean the footpath, so uh, let's go and get it. location where the uh, cash was so I thought it was a pretty good idea if I leave it out for now I thought it'd look a bit suspicious not only holding a GPS and a camera so we're gonna head on along the footpath and try and get some other geocaches I don't know if you can see this but here we have a gorse bush and if you want to know why the gorse bush is so significant, that's because that is the type of bush that pricked me when I went on Cleve Hill on my third video. Was it a second video? Right, we are literally on top of the geocache. 11 metres away. We're closing in. Okay, we're not closing in, we walked past it supposedly. Okay, I was a bit concerned then because the GPS, I just couldn't pinpoint it, so I calibrated the compass and I can see it now. I know where it is. Can you see it? Can you see it? Can you see it? There it is. Right, on to the next one. We shall go. Sorry, I got a bit lost just then. When I say lost, I lost the footpath. I had to do a real steep climb. Double back on myself. And we are closing on the geocache. This is a micro. Oh dear. Okay, just found a second geocache. Okay, film canister. Let me show you the view I got when I was signing that cache, it's, it's pretty impressive. Okay, here we are. GPS has gone off. But I'm thinking this structure has something to do with it. New geocache shows base of tree and it's a small one. Could be trying to throw me off. Okay, so if you were looking for the geocache, you'd look over there. Big beacon sign. But no, it's over here. That wasted a lot of my time, but we found it, so we're going to move on to the next one. Guess what everyone, the geocache is hidden amongst this green uh, bush and I have been searching for a long time and I was about to give up and I thought oh, I'll just have one last look and I've just spotted it, I've got to go around the other side though, I just spotted it in a camouflage bag.
be honest, this one was really annoying me because it's a regular size. Pretty big size geocache, so. Big log book, anyway. Uh, the 18th. Well, that was the last geocache of our trip, everyone. We are now going to make our way back to the Jeep, back to the tiny village of Dumbleton, and I'm going to have some lunch because it's about that time and I'm getting hungry. Anyway, everyone, thank you so much for watching this video of my geocaching adventures. And as always, I will see you in my next geocaching video. Bye. I was just on my way back to the car and I just found this really weird place. I'm going to show you, look. Look at it. I can only... I don't even know what this could be. Pretty fancy though. I mean, look where this is. Never seen that before. I thought you might like to see it. Because I did. <laughs>